Welcome back to Into the Radius, the closed beta for the new MetaQuest native version. While we're getting started here, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 25,000 subscribers, it would be fantastic if you were one of them. Also like, share, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the video, or the beta so far, or any tips or tricks you have for Into the Radius. We're just returning from our first mission. So we're going to do a delivery, the first expedition, and hopefully we have that bracelet somewhere in this mess. There it is. We got a green light, complete the mission. And accept our new security level. All right, you have to undergo training to confirm it. Proceed to the shooting range. Wasn't expecting that, but let's go check out the shooting range. We're going to continue our tutorial then. Ooh, we're getting paid for our training. All right. Welcome back, Explorer. This is the UNPSC training facility. To confirm your access level, you must pass a qualification test. Upon completing the procedure, you will be granted rights to buy better equipment. Press and hold trigger to enable throwing mode. So, the grip doesn't change that much yet, but probably will in the final release. Nice. Probes. We talked about probes already. Sweet. I don't want to put them on my sleeve slot. I want to put them on my chest. That's how I roll. But we'll do what they say for now. And now we have our detector. Doesn't look as green as it does on the quest. Okay, there it is. Ooh, good money. The potato artifact. We've got another one. Can also detect special monsters, rifts. we supposed to do here? Do we have our pistol? We do not. Produces a valuable shard. So, rifts are like enemy spawners. At an interval they will respawn enemies. What's next? So you want to destroy them quickly. Get your map out! That is the tide counter. So, tide's like four days, and when it ends, Everything in the zone respawns uh, entity-wise. There's, there's some exceptions for items. Ooh, 
needs repair. So it's going to jam. And there's the jam. Just have to rack it if we have any ammo. We don't have any more ammo. The mag is empty. I'm not sure that jammed like it was supposed to. There's a jam. I think we were just lucky that it didn't jam the first time. Okay. I don't think we need this anymore. Let's move on. Put the PM in the vise. So it's in the yellow, which means it needs some oil and brush. Give it a spritz and start scrubbing off the grime. You can see it's already in the blue, which means now we need the ramrod and uh, paper or roll of patch. There we go. Okay, let's open the item info, cleaning rod. And you can fix everything in the repair box. Something happened with that. Yeah, something's up with that texture. Almost there. And now we're up to perfect condition. Moving on. Despite our best efforts, the only ones able to enter the radius, the former inhabitants of Pechorsk, die of organ failure if leaving the two kilometers zone around them. The committee needs your help in exploring the phenomenon and finding a cure. A cure, huh? The radius is clearly hostile, and only you can shield humanity from its dangers. I accept. All right, done our training. We've got another 500 credits. Let's go uh, sell what we want to sell, and then we'll pick up another mission. Now, normally I would hoard all of the guns that I find, but I don't really want to do that for this playthrough. It'd be nice to have a backup, but I think I'm just gonna toss most of these, sell empty boxes, Spotting scope is worthless. We're gonna start stacking these papers over here. There are a lot of these in the game, so you gotta make space. Uh, we'll keep one extra detector. Those actually the ammo we're using? I think they are. So we'll just empty those for the ammo. That doesn't even have a magazine, so that's fine. Okay.
the rest can stay in there. Toothbrush can go. Uh, all right. Not a lot. Uh, we don't need these. We don't need that many extra magazines. Okay, um, we have our extra detector, so that one can go in there. Now we need to buy more ammo. That can go in there. Is this full then? That's full, which is nice. That can go in there. All right. Oh, we have a shard too, but we might need that for a mission, so let's hold on to it for now. 104. So we've got two grand. We definitely need more ammo, but let's see. Oh, security level two, the headlamp is fantastic. It means we don't have to carry the flashlight, but flashlight it is. And we'll just stick with the PM for now. So nine by 18 ammo. All we can get is the uh, FMJ. We may just splurge on the big box right now because we're going to be using the 9x18 FMJ for a while. So let's do that. And what else? Uh, we have two med injectors. We could go for another one of those. It's probably in survival. 220. Yeah, let's do that. Another two. Okay, uh, I guess I only bought one, that's fine. Um, shard can go there, that'll go there. That we will use first off to fill up our magazines. And we may have to go see what cleaning supplies we have. I'm not sure if we have any oil. Okay. Can that go in there? We gotta take it out. There we go. All right. So we have ammo. Let's go see if we have cleaning supplies. What's the condition? Just need the uh, cleaning rod, really, which we do not have. We'd have to go buy one. Uh, we got food there. Oh, we got a shotgun here. So let's go ahead and load that up. Okay. And that will go over our shoulder. We'll probably find another shotgun. Shotguns are all over the zone. Missions. Find the film. Okay. So let's keep the shard here for now in case that's the next mission. And let's go buy a ramrod and some paper. And let's also, okay, that's full, and that's full too. That's good. Anything over here? Extra probes. We'll put those down there with our backup detector, just in case we lose either, which is easy to do in the zone. Our health is good, so we are looking for weapon cleaning. So we want a cleaning rod and some paper. Okay, and we may as well 
get some oil while we're here. Okay, just put that there for now. And then Oh, we did have oil. Sometimes it doesn't go in the vise. There's a trick to it, which uh, I constantly forget. Hmm. Doesn't seem like it's improving much. So it may be that the info is not updating. Okay, it is fully repaired now. So that's good. We've got three med injectors, which should be enough for this mission. Um, how much cash do we have? I don't even think we have enough to buy another. Maybe we can find one. What is that? Is that a regen? So a regen artifact will actually heal you, so that's kind of just the thing we want to supplement our med injectors. And we do have extra probes and an extra detector over there. Okay, so lots of food, lots of drinks, lots of ammo. Now we're just worried about time. So I don't want to head out at this time. I want to sleep till morning, and then we'll take this next mission. So let's do that. So we'll wake up at 6 a.m. Uh, we're going to need some food. Let's grab that. Open it up. I would like another knife. That saves ammo. So you can see as we eat, the yellow should recede and the blue should climb up. Okay, so that little piece of meat we don't need. Oh, we ate it anyway, so that's good. So now we'll drop a save. Do to do where we at here there we will accept the mission which is in the warehouse in Pervame route and we'll head out into the zone this is a misty morning or is that my headset interesting there's like a fog okay we're not fully equipped yet, just because it's early in the game. You can look around the base for things. There's some food and a flashlight. There are some mimics in the warehouse. That load triggered faster than I was expecting. What happened there? That kind of triggered us returning. Very odd. So that seems like a bug. Now it's 8 a.m. We just lost two hours somehow. That's okay. We can deal with it. Did we accept a mission? Let's check that. We did. Find the film. Okay. Um, we have our weapon. I think we're okay to continue. So that was most definitely a beta bug. All right. So to get to the warehouse, we can head this way. I'm not familiar with the anomalies over here, or I haven't checked it with this version. On the PCVR version, 
2.0. They're pretty sparse over here. There's some fragments up here, maybe some spawns, but no mimics. There is a, huh, that's new. Well, there's a spawn over there. It looks like dodging the spawns and knifing them is the way to go in this version. It's coming over. Just want to make sure you have enough room so that you don't run into an anomaly. It's going to jump. So let's start strafing. There. Jumped again. Where'd it go? Okay, I think that's done. Okay. Save the ammo and we'll stab the core. Just took one little hit, but we're not in danger right now, hopefully. What? Why was that three rounds? Curious. did see an anomaly here. That ticking is for an artifact up here. Maybe we'll just go and grab it. Some anomalies you really shouldn't uh, throw probes into called reflectors. I think we have to get at this from the other side. Yeah, there's one there, one there. Okay, we'll get that on the way back. In these anomaly fields, there's usually a way through without getting hit, but it can be on basically any side. Here's another spawn. Okay, we l our knife is done, but I don't think there'll be any more spawns over here. But I'm curious what this structure is, because it's new to this version. got a tape. That's weird. Okay, we want to get out of here because something's coming. Must be a ways off. might not be able to get up to us, but we don't want it screaming and alerting everyone. There it is. Okay. We may be able to just ignore that fragment. Although we may get up this little hill. Yeah, he's gonna get up and we are at risk the warehouse is right there. The mimics would see us. So let's uh, get a little further up here before we take care of this fragment. All right, and we don't have a suppressor yet.
Seems like a fragment down there. I am going to drop another save just before we enter the warehouse. Now there are explodables in the warehouse area. Some uh, propane canisters that we can make use of if the enemies are kind. There is also, you can hear, a uh, rift, which we're gonna wanna take out. That looks like a mimic up there on that hill. We're gonna try to take out this rift first thing. Seems to be in this building and then it's not going to respawn the enemies. Okay, Rift is down. Let's back up. So now the enemies are not going to respawn. Take just a second to get that extra round in there. We don't have a lot. Okay. So we want to make them count. There's a mimic right there. He's on to us. Let's hustle back here. Health is not too bad. Let's get to an area that can reload our magazine. Kind of hear somebody coming. whole bunch of fragments. Another one, eh? All right. Let's check out the warehouses now. We can at least check out the one where we took out the rift. I don't like this distance for the shotgun. Okay, let's go around the side here. Avoid the grassy anomalies. Can we get that? Yeah. Put that there for now. back to the flashlight. Okay. Let's take that. I'll uh, put this here for now. Okay, that's done. Let's go back to the PM. 
think I dropped the med injector there. Yeah, I don't want to be doing that. We got a camera here to sell. Yeah, it is a pain without the headlamp. All right. Another med injector. Just put that there. Some more shotgun ammo. And a cigarette. I'm not going to bother. Some probes. Okay. Flashlight. It's good to sell. Let's put that there. And that can go there too. I think there should be a crate in here, if I'm not mistaken. There we go, a white crate, probably a shotgun. All right, let's put that away. So that can go on the side of our pack for now. And then just some more shotgun ammo, looks like. There's some food. Might be a bit of a pain to get to it. here. And we'll head into the building. All right. Let's just adjust for a second. So the film is in this building here. There is also some loot in that structure there. For this building, we'll go with the shotgun. A knife is nice. That it's just straight up loot we can sell, which is great. Some food, if I can target it. All right. Most of the stuff you pick up, unless you can use it, it's not worth very much. Keep the light moving. Okay, let's put that away for a second. We'll look for the film. That's just a cell. Knife will take. And we'll just shove it in the side here for now. Can we get that? No. Okay. What is that? That's a lighter. We'll take this stuff. We don't really need it. is the film though it's being a pain it's in here somewhere a film or something kid is crazy about photography oh there's the film 
right there. So that's our mission objective. This is just loot. Okay. We can just look for more loot over here. I'm not going to spend a ton of time. It's like I said, most of the stuff you pick up is not worth anything. Unless you can use it like food. And there's a tape. Shine your light around to clear this stuff, although it can be tricky sometimes. Just keep your light moving and then move through. Okay. Just want to make sure I didn't forget my shotgun. All right. Let's check out this uh, broken down structure here. If you hear a beeping that is not in the game, that is a truck backing up past my play space. We're walking slow because we're basically overburdened now. Shouldn't be a problem. It's a detector we don't need. Head downstairs here. N not a lot going on down here. We've got a scope we can sell and maybe some information about a stash. Okay. It is getting late and we are moving slowly so. That's our cue to head out. We'll just uh, tap Katya on our way by. My father was a truck driver. He'd be away for long periods of time on inner city routes. I wish he'd been away when the event happened, but it was right around his birthday. We still had unfinished cake in the fridge. Napoleon, his favorite. He taught me to drive when I was very young. We had a lot of fun. My father was the silent type and didn't spend much time with us girls, but driving was something he could share with me. Though we didn't know when or how I'd get a car of my own. I was really looking forward to that day. Ah, the freedom. And what do I have to look forward to now? You might be my only hope. No pressure. Okay, we're gonna stay low for a second. I saw... Oh, he's coming. Let's get over here. I don't know if he saw us. Okay, let's move. You don't get any loot from enemies in this game, but they will flock to the sound of gunshots. That's why suppressors are important, but also don't hang around. Okay, we've got two anomalies here. Let's go around the other side. Okay, we're going to use a med injector just because we were down to half health there. I'm not sure how exactly. Now, we already cleared this portion. But like I said, I'm not entirely familiar with the anomalies in this version. So I'm going to be careful and do a little probing as we hustle out and I am going to skip that artifact up there for now we still have lots of time left on the tide to come back and get it okay 
one of the things we should do is check our mission. One of one, we have completed it. Should really do that after you pick up what you think is the mission objective. That way you know for sure. You don't want to leave the area and then find out it's not what you thought it was. Okay, I think we can go through here. Head straight for the path. Yeah, we're good. So it looks like they got rid of stamina drain in the base, which is great. So let's go, oh, maybe they didn't, it is going down. Let's go turn in our mission item. Which is down there. Complete. Two grand. And let's sell what we know we're gonna sell One of our flashlights is on. That, that, that. Make sure it's in there. We're gonna, yeah, that's empty. Uh, we have two of those now, so let's sell that one. Don't need that. Um, Ammo will keep for now, so I think that might be it. Pretty good haul. I'm not going to keep weapons, but I'll probably keep ammo, because you never know what weapon we're going to buy. So you can see, that gives us another almost 1400 And then we'll start an ammo table over here. So nine by 19. And I don't know where, why we're getting NATO at this point, but there it is. Uh, lighter we could have sold. We have one that can go up here. Don't need it just now. And then tapes. Tapes give you information about the zone and about the enemies in the zone. Uh, knife can go over here for now. That one's about to break. Oh yeah, we have another shotgun that we can just sell. So let's do that. We don't need two of these. $81. So mission two complete. Let's see what's in store next. All right. So we have shards, we don't have broken shards, so we can't turn that in. That's pretty good. We already cleared out the train station, so we should be able to take that one in and out. Uh, that's pretty close. We've cleared a lot of this. We can probably take on a bunch of these missions at once, and we'll do that next time. Let's, uh, can we open this? No, not yet. At least. Oh, we can, great. All right, well, there you go. This is the closed beta of the MetaQuest version of Into the Radius. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 25,000 subscribers would be fantastic if you're one of them. Also like, share, leave a comment. 
Let me know what you think of the video or the beta or any tips or tricks you have for Into the Radius. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time.